like a very busy start to the season. It's all come around very quickly and another away trip to Boreham Wood tomorrow. So what are your thoughts ahead of that clash? Yeah, the, the challenges always come thick and fast. Uh, that's the nature of the league, a, a quick turnaround, you know, two, two away travels in a row. So plenty of challenges. Um, but again, I think we can be very encouraged by our performance on Saturday, um, you know, to go toe to toe with, with the quality uh, that Chesterfield possess. I think we can take a lot of encouragement from. On another day, we could have definitely got something out of the game. Um, but we've got to make sure that we, we build on those positives. Um, you know, there's another challenge, a real tough challenge coming um, against Ball and Wood, who are always one of the stronger sides in the league, and they started really well. Um, so we, you know, we're going to face some some different type of challenges against them as well, ones we've got to stand up against. Um, but again, we've um, we've got to focus on ourselves and continue to build on on the good work that we probably done last week. Um, but like I said, we're still far from the finished article, and we're just looking for that constant improvement, improvement, um, and hopefully refine a few bits. But like I said, there's not not too much time to do too much work after a long away travel last Saturday. So. We'll just have to take take a account of everyone's fitness levels. I so said we're quite a small small group, so we've got to want to want to keep that continuity, but also got to make sure we keep that freshness as well. Yeah, exactly. Looking back to Chesterfield on Saturday, we created a lot of good chances. We were very unlucky in a few mm. cases of those. Is it just about finding a bit more cutting edge, maybe up top, and getting those goals? Yeah, I think I think moments in games can really breed confidence, and we went agonisingly close a few times. Um, and then those feel-good moments in the game to really kick that confidence into gear. So uh, that's what we're looking at at the moment. But we were certainly uh, hard-working and organised and uh, felt that we created, like you said, a lot of chances. Um, now it's a, bit a case of, yeah, can we find that little bit of quality when it matters, that little bit of cutting edge? And I'm sure that will you know, further in enhance the confidence of the group. And we've already talked about it being you know, a quick turnaround again with another away game. So what kind of difficulties does that, does that you know, provide to the, to the team? Yeah, look, the nature of this league, it's, it's, it's tough, you know, you've got you, you, the travel, uh, you know, so sometimes it's the work off the pitch is just as important on the pitch at the moment, such a tight turnaround that how the lads recover, you know, you're asking them to be professional away from the football club as well, um, you know, the work can't really run, run them too hard today, so you try and do a little bit more work, whether it's, you know, tactically or whether it's, on, you know, a bit more analysis, so you're looking for any which way to try and get... Um, as much into them but but also you know we've got to focus on ourselves and like, like I said there was a good good performance on Saturday so we're just looking to build on that. And in terms of that recovery were there any knocks at all on, on Saturday that to, to report any anybody? Yeah I thought, I, yeah the, the, the changes I thought it was great to make the changes that we did on, on Saturday like I said I think Josh McCoy starting was a real bonus for us so he's, he's coming back into contention now and he got 60 minutes which was more than we were, were expecting um, Giles come on, which was great. He's back into training, and we managed to get him on for minutes. And uh, obviously Justin Amazula as well. Um, all of those changes were almost enforced where there was there was knocks. Um, so look, uh, hopefully all of them are not too serious, and they'll all be in contention for for tomorrow. Um, so yeah, it was probably just it was great to see those players out there, and it's definitely the you know the was the plan to get them on, but we sort of got enforced into making them, which probably just made us a couple of tactical tweaks we wanted to make. We probably couldn't quite get, get it out there on Saturday, uh, but look, that's, the, that's the nature of the game. And uh, we've certainly made a step forward, and that was one of the positives, is that we got minutes into players on, on their way back. So, uh, you know, we, we certainly looked stronger on Saturday when you, when you look round at the bench as well. I think there was some good experienced players on there to come on, and we had some good experience on the pitch too. In terms of the opponents um, tomorrow night, Boreham Wood, obviously another side that finished high up there last mm. season. Um, we, we saw a, a vast improvement against Chesterfield. So we, we, is it all about carrying that on now? Yeah, look, we've got to focus on ourselves and, and you know, keep our momentum. Um, we've also got to you know, keep refining and being the best we can. But you also have to give a lot of respect to, to the opposition that you're playing. And we, cert we certainly do that. Um, we know they have some a, a range of threats. Um, they're very effective in the way that they play. A very experienced, you know, good manager again. And you know, this is this is what this league's all about. You're tested every single week. You you've got to be right on your game, and um, that's what we've got to be. Um, you know, as we're building. You know, like I said on Saturday, we're certainly in build stage. It's our second competitive game together. This will be our third, and we're just looking. You know, to keep building and keep keep improving in in every aspect we can, and that, and that's the challenge for us. You know, we can't concern ourselves too much with what other teams are doing. We've got to make sure we, we put our best foot forward, our best performance out there, but, but it's along the, the lines of still showing respect to the opponent in, in, in the way that we prepare and the way that we work.